hello students welcome back to my channel in this video i am going to discuss in detail about the differential aeration corrosion this type of corrosion arises due to the difference in the concentration of air or oxygen differential aeration corrosion is due to the difference in the air or oxygen concentration especially the more oxygenated part of the metal becomes cathode and protected from corrosion whereas the poorly oxygenated part of the metal becomes anode and undergo corrosion so poorly oxygenated part or less oxygenated part of the metal undergo corrosion so let us see one good example whenever a zinc rod is partially immersed in nacl solution the less oxygenated part become anode and undergo corrosion so it is NaCl solution this is the zinc rod which is partially immersed this particular area is more oxygenated it experiences high oxygen concentration with the result it becomes cathode and protected from the corrosion and especially if we carefully observe the bottom part it experiences poor oxygen so it is poorly oxygenated part and becomes anode and undergo corrosion with the result the corrosion product will be deposited at the bottom it is good example for differential aeration corrosion this type of corrosion arises due to the difference in the air or oxygen corrosion good examples of differential aeration corrosion includes drop corrosion drop corrosion means if we consider an iron rod the metal which is under the drop of water or salt solution undergo corrosion and this corrosion is due to difference in air concentration similarly we can also consider one more example 
and that is called as water line corrosion and this water line corrosion is also due to difference in air concentration mostly the line which is just beneath the water level undergo corrosion and it is especially due to less oxygenated part so the line just to below the water meniscus is less oxygenated part and it becomes anode and undergo corrosion so which part of the water tank undergo corrosion the line just beneath the water meniscus undergo corrosion all these are good examples of differential aeration corrosion if you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a nice day